Morning Brew with friends, and we are back with our one of my favorite segments of the week. It's trending with Joan Marie. What is going on, Joan? Happy New Year, and what I'd actually like to start with with the first Wednesday and trending with Joan Marie segment of the year is a look back at to what we what we saw last year. And now, if you don't know, I'm a huge football fan. One of my favorite teams is the Broncos. Sadly, we're not doing so well right now. Um, but if you do remember from last year, Deflate Gate. That was a very large topic that we had with Mr. Brady. Now, whether you believe it, that he actually deflated the ball or not, that's still controversial. You can tweet us and ask us about that. Up next was What It Do Miley with Nicki Minaj. And that was actually when Nicki Minaj called out Miley Cyrus on stage when they were actually having like a off-topic battle of sorts. Um, Street Out of Compton was a really big thing. People were making memes out of Street Out of Albuquerque, Street Out of Phoenix, Street Out of whatever you wanted because they had that great meme gift creator on there for online. So that was all over Twitter and Facebook. Best movie of the year. Um, that was just. I'm just saying. I'm not. I'm not saying. I'm just greatest movie of the year. <laughs> Amazing film. Well, if you think that was, maybe you can Netflix and chill it next, because that is mm. actually what came about last year, was Netflix and chill. Now, my idea of Netflix and chill is curling up with my dog on my bed with my laptop, but so for others, they take it a little bit further. Um, then it was actually Katy Perry's The Left Shark. I feel for this shark, seriously. Like, can you see out of those eyes? If you didn't catch it, the shark was a little off by like a full eight count up there. So unfortunately, I'm pretty sure it's not something I'd want to list on my resume for my next dancing off. Um, Hello was a very big hit, and there were gifts, memes, videos, parodies of Hello, and you probably remember my Miss Piggy one that I actually did when they did for the Muppets. Um, Drake who taught us that not all of us are bad dancers, that there are people that are worse than us, which for me, that's actually really good because I suck. Um, llamas took over Arizona when two llamas escaped from their actual circus and they went on a joyous run and no one could catch them for the longest time to go over national news. Um, the dress, is it black and blue or is it white and gold? You tell me, the whole science thing, so good luck. Um, grumpy Dog. Now, for those that are not fans of the cat, you now have Grumpy Dog to follow yourself. Um, now, this one is Bagel Pigeon. So one of, my, uh, one of my tech people in the back, she came up with the best version for this, and it's the Inbred Pigeon. Ba -da -ba. Get it? See? All right. <laughs> and now I leave you with the current trending video right now, and it's basically what we can say goodbye to of 2015. And so you can't help but just cry when you see this. He's actually dropped a piece of candy of some sort. I don't know what kind of candy, but it's just, there it goes. Let it go, right? Let it go, Dan. Do you remember that? I, I feel bad for that poor squirrel. I'm just, <laughs> it's just heartbreaking. because he dropped a raccoon. <laughs> he dropped his candy in the water and loses it. Heartbreaking. So, so what do you think the big trends are going to be for 2016? Are we going to see more llamas running? Are we going to see more grumpy other kinds of grumpy animals? Am I going to see a grumpy seal or something? Maybe. That'd be kind of fun. But honestly, I think we're going to see a lot of political gifts and memes and things uh, trending just because tis the season for all of that fun jazz. And I like the maybe some pizza gifts. Oh, I miss Pizza Rat. Pizza Rat was just was pizza not rat. a homeless rat or anything. was not a thief. It was just trying to feed his Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles son. <laughs> so that's all he was trying to do. So. <laughs> well, I know these were, those were the biggest trends of the year. What do you think some of the the ones that carry on through 2016 will be one of the videos we still will be watching Drake hotline bling is still a trending one Adele with her new songs I mean those things are still huge her album I mean is ridiculous Justin Bieber unfortunately he will never go away so he'll still be in our periphery I'm sure are you a believer I am not a believer. Okay. I was never a believer. Otherwise, that makes me a pedophile, okay? <laughs> like, I might be single, but that's not where I look in my, my radar. How old um, is he now? He's like 22, 23. Wow. He's way too young for me. Right. So my Tinder profile, not there at no, all. He, so. He's a total swipe right. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, no, he's swipe left. Swipe right is a yes. Swipe left is a no. Oh, I forget. So that explains <laughs> a lot of problems I've been having. <laughs>
<laughs> Full circle. Um, but no, I definitely see um, stuff with Justin Bieber, politics. We're probably going to see some more movie stuff. Adele. Um, we're going to see a lot more. Just any kind of like people flubs that they're making, like maybe like the Miss Universe flub. Yeah, that of, was you a know, pretty amazing. And the one. winner is just kidding. So that was soon. pretty amazing. That broke my heart. I felt so bad. I mean, I can't. I mean, you know me. I did pageants for 17 years. I cannot imagine that feeling of you have it and then you've got to let it go. I just, I couldn't do that. Well, just like that uh, squirrel losing his candy. <sighs> heartbreaking. So heartbreaking. heartbreaking. <laughs> we'll be back in a couple of seconds. We're going to bring everybody back. We're talking about film festivals, Comic-Con, Burnley Oak County, trending stuff, and more on The Morning Brew with Friends.